All right, now we're doing 8Q, correct the mistakes of the character recognition software. This is by Dennis Nori, and 93% of the people like it. Character recognition software is widely used to digitize printed texts. Thus, the text can be edited, searched, and stored on a computer. When documents, especially pretty old ones writ written with a typewriter, are digitized, character recognition software often makes mistakes. Your task is to correct the errors in the digitized text. You only have to handle the following mistakes. S is misinterpreted as 5, O as 0, I as 1. The test cases contain numbers only by mistake, all right? So in this one, we're going to be using string.prototype.replace. And the replace method returns a new string with some or all matches of a pattern replaced by a replacement. The pattern can be a string or regex, and the replacement can be a string or a function to be called for each match. If pattern is a string, only the first occurrence will be replaced. The original string is left unchanged, right? So right here, you can see uh, they want to replace dog with monkey. So here's dog. Ah, oh, but here's monkey, right? But here's dog again, and here's dog again, because it only does the first occurrence, right? All right, so they do it again over here. And you see dog, and they replace it with ferret, and ferret, but dog again here, because it only does the first occurrence. But if you put G after your regex, it'll find them all. That's for sure. Uh, and here's regular expressions. If you don't know regular expressions, it's just good to go to this page or any page that's talking about regular expressions and just read up on it uh, and try to understand as best you can. All right. Anyway, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to say string. I'm going to say replace. Excuse me return first and then string dot replace and inside there we're going to do some regex and we're going to say <clears throat> pardon me we're going to say we're going to replace uh five and g because that's global uh with s capital s capital s right there all right cool and now i'm just going to do this Drop it down two more times. We're going to say zero here and O here and what was the other one? One and I. All right. Pretty sure that'll work. Let's see. It did. It did. Awesome. Awesome. And look, the 20 random tests were faster than the uh, one test. So that's good. Anyway, so that's that, and very much like it. My solutions, 935, best practice, and we'll see you next time.